Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your monthly reading for October 2020. Everything you need to know about this reading is in the description box below. If this is about you and another person, this could resonate with theirs or your moon rising or Venus sign. All right. Hello Sagittarius. October 2020. October 2020. All right. Let's see. The Devil. That could be Capricorn. Nine of Swords was what I was going to put there, but that was left. So, okay. Ace of Cups. All right. Three of Wands. The Hermit. I'm not going to be able to see this down here. The Empress. Could be Taurus, Aries, or Libra. Two of Wands, this could be Virgo. The Chariot, that could be Cancerian. So we got one, two, three, four. All right. Three, four. Oh, yeah, we've got four major arcana here. Okay, so uh, hmm. this is pretty significant. All right. meet somebody new hmm? we gotta we got some new here it's this ace of cups for Sagittarius hmm. you feel like you're keeping something all to your like it <laughs> feels like you're well, maybe it's because something's in the beginning stages. The chariot. Look at that. Okay. Did you meet somebody? You're worried about old patterns repeating. That's this three of wands. Or it, okay. I'm <laughs> or is it just a physical relationship right now? And you're like, yes. Like that's making you happy. Okay. What's this three of wands about? Seven of pentacles. <laughs> You need to slow down a little bit and keep your options open. <laughs> this is Hermit about Sagittarius. Oh, Nine of Cups. Okay. All right. What's this Empress about for Sagittarius? Okay. So this is something that it feels like you you're you're going really fast <laughs> and it might be that uh you need to maybe slow it down a little bit just to let some reality catch up with the feelings or the hormones <laughs> um it it just feels like you're it's getting away from you and that's it's not a bad thing it just i i think there's this fear though that you're going to wake up um in three months and you'll find the same situation again like you, it feels the way you feel feels good but at the same time it's like you don't trust yourself fully yet and that's okay you just it's just a matter of slowing things down a little bit that's all right and and keeping your options open and still doing all the daily things that you do and all that other stuff i mean but let's be honest who's been doing anything right but <laughs> um still keeping some of yourself to yourself and, and slowing things down a little bit. And um, the thing is, whatever you've got, <laughs> it says change, two of pentacles. Whatever uh, has just started is actually worth going a little further with, just not at the breakneck speed perhaps you've been going. <laughs> so um, just keep keep your options open there. This is, this is something that could really um, be something. Just got to slow it down a little bit here. What's this two of wands for Sagittarius? Oopsie. The hermit. So we got the hermit twice here. All right. What's this 
chariot. So that's that's what it is. It's okay. So you know what? You whatever it is. I mean, it could be a new job. Whatever it is, it's keeping you quite. Um, it's very exciting, and it's 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 something that you're very um, caught up in, and that's again, that's fine. I think you are worried that it's going too fast and you might not um, be able to stop it or the momentum or it's starting to feel familiar like it always goes down this road, whatever situation this is, a new job or new relationship, new whatever it is, whatever this new thing is, it's like, it's almost like you're going along at this steady clip and yet you're starting to realize, hey, I've been here before. I don't want it to turn out like it does, but you're you're keeping going. And it's like, that's all. So that awareness is everything because then it, it allows you to go, hey, let's just pump the brakes a little bit and see what unfolds. Um, a really good shot here. I mean, there's potential here for, for this. There's potential. Look at this. We got Taurus here twice. <laughs> there's potential for this. It's just, you need to be able to slow down to think about things as you go. There needs to be time to settle in, you know? All right. And time to think about things and think about choices, not just going along because that's what you've always done because it's it's how you've always done things. Um, no, the how to combat that or how to um, not get caught up in that and the momentum because that's fun, why not? But it, you also have to have some time by yourself to think about what you still want if this feels right, especially if you're used to sort of doing things a certain way and you find yourself being aware of, hey, I don't want this, but you still do the same things physically um, or you still go through the motions socially, physically, whatever, because it's almost like, well, I'll just, I'll, I'll worry about it later. Let's just get through the situation. Let's just kind of, you know, okay, I'll, I'll capitulate or I'll go along or not capitulate, but I'll, yeah, okay, fine. It's not that big of a deal. And then three weeks later, you're like, oh, I should have never let that because now we're here and I don't, this is too much. I don't want this, eh, you know, could be that regret. So um, it's just slowing things down. That's all. Feels really good. Just want to work in the daily routine. That's all. Have your wits about you. Have, have as much alone time as you have together time so that you can balance that out with some introspection Think about how you feel, how it's going. Um, is this a good fit? And this, again, this could be job. This could be, um, feels like relationship, not gonna lie. Um, one that it's a very physically successful, <laughs> compatible relationship. What's this chariot about for Sagittarius? Knight of Swords. Uh, I read that as Aquarius. So we've got Chariot and the Knight of Swords. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Gosh. So you, you know what? Honestly, it feels like you've met someone with a similar um, disposition or you have a job that you really feel drawn to and you like and you're putting in all these hours. It's something that kind of needs to be pulled back. So if this is a relationship, job, whatever this is, it feels really good, but you need to pump the brakes a little bit. Um, you're, you're getting a little ahead of what the situation is. Um, the thing is, though, it, you really feel drawn to either this person or this adventure, this who, whatever this is, you really feel a fit here. And you're not one to you know, deny yourself, which you shouldn't, good for you. But I think, I I, I feel like you're going to wake up in three weeks and be like, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm right where I always am when it gets this far or, and you're, you're going to beat yourself up or you're not going to trust yourself. And the thing is, this has some good potential here. You have found a fit either with this person, they match your energy level or this job, um, you're really feeling like you could go places with this job. It could even be a physical move. Um, but just uh, build some time in for you to have some time by yourself to think about and process what you've done. 
what you're experiencing, how you feel about it. Are you still okay? Do you want to take a couple days off? You need to think it's moving too fast for me. What do I, just, just make sure that you have that downtime or alone time to check in with yourself. No, this is fun. I want to keep going. Okay, we'll keep going. But then when you come home or whatever, make sure you, you know, you're checking and balancing. You know what I mean? What else for? Sagittarius. It's funny because this is, it's, it's like this is very behind the scenes for you as far as um, there's been a shift because this is new. So you've been doing the, for the Sagittarians I'm reading for, you've been doing the work and something just landed and you're going for it, which you should, you deserve it. This speaks to you having regrets though, not that you need to, but it speaks to you all of a sudden, three weeks, six weeks later going, <gasps> and it's like, you don't need to. How you combat that, you slow things down now and you still partake, you just don't, Make it into something it's not yet. But this has potential. All right. What else for Sagittarius? Just trying to keep your wits about you so you don't beat yourself up and sabotage it. <laughs> Sagittarius. Angel of Miracles. Open your heart and expect a miracle. And here I am saying, no, pump the brakes. <laughs> okay. Yes, open your heart. Yes, expect a miracle. Yes, yes, yes. But you're going to get to the miracle at 10 miles an hour. And you're going to get to the miracle at 60 miles an hour. You get to enjoy it a little more if you go at 10 miles an hour. <laughs> All right. What else for Sagittarius? Oh, I hate that you can't see that. Beautiful cards. Okay. <laughs> Perspective. Archangel Chamuel. Chamuel? Mm. There's a better way. Pause for reflection <laughs> and insight. Dare to be different. Yes, go against what you've always done before, what you feel compelled to repeat because this, I don't know how not to. Yes, you do. And even if you don't, that's fine. You're keeping your options open. You're going slow. That's the benefit of going slow is that you can just change your mind or you can go, oh, I'm going to try it this way. Baby steps, baby steps. Yeah, just need a little perspective here. This is uh, Hangman. It's going to be Pisces. So that's all right. You're just getting rid of some old habits. You're going to try something new. Take it a little slower. All right. Sagittarius for October. Sagittarius. Ten of Pentacles on its side. Ten of Wands on its side. <laughs> okay. All right. So this is learning as you go. This is, this is not repeating because you have perspective. You're not repeating the same old patterns. You just don't know how not to. So you're learning as you go and that's okay. And you're trying, this is change. This is something new. This is different. Um, and it's probably happened suddenly. So it's a bit off, you know, it's not that you're not up for it. It's just like, whoa. So that's all right. Go for it. Just make sure you have that time for yourself. Also, you get that perspective. Things are shifting. Um, it's almost like it's been shifting for a while behind the scenes. You got yourself in the clear and then this kind of came rushing in and you're going for it and you should. And I, I said this before that there's, and, and people have been very gracious and, and said in the comments, um, what's opening up in October. I think there's like a couple of retrogrades that went direct or there's like three major transits and shifts and all that. So this would make sense because this is like, yes, <laughs> you're not wasting any time here. So, um, just, I just don't want you beating yourself up later because, oh, I did it again. No, you didn't. It's all right. It's nothing. You can't backtrack or slow down. This has got potential. Let's see where it goes. You're shifting. You're learning. This is new. Every, this is, this is new. This is different. Baby steps. Baby steps, but not really, because we have the chariot and the knight of swords. <laughs> but baby steps. 
Baby steps, but have fun. Make good choices. Okay, all right. You, you know what I mean. Okay. <laughs> all right, so uh, happy October to you, Sagittarius. Much love to you. I hope to see you in the next reading. And you have fun. And you, and baby steps, you know why baby steps? So you can trust yourself. It's not about trusting the other person. It's about trusting yourself. Because it's all fun when it's fun. Right? It's easy to trust when it's fun. It's when things start getting weird or when maybe some red flags prop up. That's when it matters that you took things slower because you built up that trust and those um, expectations of respect and all that. So when something's out of line, you can speak to it. You don't feel like, oh, well, I'll just, you know, or you just bolt. No, you can address it with confidence because you trust yourself. You don't have to trust the other person. You have to trust yourself. The other person that trust comes later, but you must trust yourself. That's the benefit of going slow. Okay, shutting up. All right. Okay, Sagittarius. I hope to see you in the next reading. You take care. Much love to you. Make good choices. <laughs> you have fun though. It's about time, right? Okay. All right. <laughs>